Media Taste of 2015 and as well as the 2015 National Finals of the World Cosplay Summit Philippine Selection. We will be doing more, more coverage on the WCSP side because as you may know, Hero will have a special for this and they will have it after uh, how many weeks? So yun. Now, as for the WCSPH National Finals, we have two teams from NCR, that's Pink, uh, Pink Tilapias and Team Canor, and one from South Luzon. So, uh, that's, uh, as far as uh, we have seen, may mga, na, nandito na, mga representatives na tayo dito. They're just waiting, they, they've just rehearsed earlier, and may mga contestants na rin tayo for the Kids Squad category. And let's take a look at the area muna, no, for the surroundings. Uh, as you can see, that's the stage. We have here boots and the photo booths and displays. And also, Star Marie is somewhere over there. And yes, Alfario. There, that, there goes the uh, guys at Alfario, Road Connection. So, hindi ilang ito bastang event. And uh, again, just to tell you, Hero Face Off 2015 is a celebration for Hero's 10th year in the industry. So far, so good. With that said, we will start the program and we will come back to you later on. second level of the entertainment mall of SM Malfacia. Kabababa lang natin sa music hall and I've just played a game uh, at the Embassy of Japan in the Philippines booth. Let's see kung anong laman nito. Uy, cool! It's a calendar. 2015 Ikebana calendar. Lapas natin. This will be replaced by calendar. At home. So, this will be for keeps. Yan. And also, uh, among the various exhibitors there are Animation Cost of the Philippines, again, the Embassy of Japan. Uh, uh, may exhibit din tayo dito ng mga toys uh, or figures. Those artists, especially Alfario, uh, parts sila ng GT Macon, by the way. So, itong mga areas na ito, these are the things that you can do if you went early in the event. Okay, so we are here at the stage, just beside the stage, and we'll give you a background of the this year's uh, World Cosplay Summit uh, Philippines coverage. Ano. So, as you can see, we've made this map, and uh, punta lang natin sa map, ano. I hope this, you can see this, ano. So, World Cosplay Summit Philippines map, ang NCR qualifiers, sakap niya ang Luzon, pero pwede rin siya sa Northern Luzon. Ang Bicol qualifiers, South Luzon qualifiers, sakap niya, pati Visayas. And the Mindanao qualifiers, as you can see, buong Mindanao na po yan. And Mindanao conference is uh, covered by Ambox Events, which is a very proactive community. Uh, by the way, uh, pustahan namin dito sa WCS is another representative of Dabao will be coming to Japan once more. And this time, they will be now, uh, Dabao will now compete, perhaps. So, yun yung pupusta namin dito. We are not yet sure since magaling-galing din yung mga ibang ano. Uh, uh, we're confident na magaling din yung mga participants natin from South Luzon and NCR. Especially Pink Tilapis and Team Canor. So, yun ang mangyayari ngayon so far. So good. And we are yet to start the dubbing session since kakatapos lang ng Battle of Gods movies uh, airing. Ay, parang walang kinain. Eh. Maganda, magandang habot po sa inyong lahat. O ano? Gotcha. Saka galing? Pinanood ka! Pinanood ka ba kanina? Kanina ko. Halika, yung nakapute. Yung nakapute. Yun yung unang unang natin. Halika, halika. Well born girl. Uy! Yambo! Ano ba kanan? Acting workshop! Yun! Acting workshop! Galing yata ako sa Mahalin Center. Hindi, pero alam ko po lang yun. Yes. Konting kalusus lang ng paamor ini. At mahal yun. Yes. 
Pasensya lang kayo. Pinanood ko kasi yung paano lumaban si Mills para makadiskarte ako. Pag ako na nakipaglaban sa kanya, ang masama, wala rin ako nagawa. Mabubugi man o tsa-tsa Ngunit ang paborito Ay ang pagsayang ang nangyibibo Nakakainda Nakakagaling Nakakatindi Gano! sa malapit sa camera din sa gitna ng uh, musical ng Mall of Asia. Umupo na po ang mga judges. We've just had a good performance by Casey Tanting and her song, the songs as her set. And malapit na po tayo magsimula sa face-off competition. Ayan, we are now here with Christian Umali. Di umali, so ito ang ibang, ibang taon to eh. Ano ba yung natabihan mo dito? Well, uh, inaaba ko eh. Yung, yung uh, main cosplay event na yun, yung chibi, tsaka yun. Especially yung pinaka-main event, yung WCS National Finals. Kaya medyo, medyo for me, medyo excited yung sa WC Urban. Dahil base sa mga napanood yung mga magagaling sila. Pero abang ako kung sinong mamamaya pag mamaya, kung sino mananalo dito sa WC, mag, magiging representante ng Pilipinas this coming August sa WCS Finals. Yun lang. Alright, thank you. Thank you. Stay in the live, sir. Nanonood ba kayo ng Day in the Live? Yes? Oh, I'm so happy guys. Buti na lang makakarelate tayo sa isa't isa't. And for our last three, the woman behind Hero Face Off 2015, the channel head of Hero TV, our one and only Miss Jojo Neri Estacio. Let's all give her a round of applause. And again, that's our judges for this year's Hero Face Off. Okay, we have here, straight from Davao, John Wizard El Sabo. Na, Naka-interview na natin to last time, uh, two years ago, I believe. Yeah. 2013, Hero Face-Off. 2013, Hero Face-Off. First time natin makakausap si John Vincent ng personal. How was it? Uh, I think it's uh, improving and upgrading and now more competitive uh, cosplayers. Now, uh, the, the previous years I've joined, it's more competitive now, and the uh, cosplayers are really good, really, really good. Confident ba, ka, confident ba kayo na makakasali kayo as a competitor? Uh, hindi ako magsasabi na confident, dahil uh, all performances are good. But uh, I want to compete also because when I competed at last time, it was only an observer. But if God permits, uh, I want to compete. But I don't know if uh, because of the performances of different teams, they're so good. Ayos. So, mag 
Napakahaba ng araw natin, napakahaba na preparations ninyo. Yung, uh, ilang say sa teams ninyo sa from, uh, from the Mindanao Conference, I've watched it early in the morning and I am very happy to say na proactive and I will pro I will still this will be best stand for WCS. Proactive ang Mindanao Conference. How does it feel na you are part of a proactive community of cosplayers? Of course, I'm really proud and happy because I belong to that uh, region because last, uh, last, 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 last year, uh, Mindanao was not uh, competing here in Manila. And when I know, uh, when people know about Mindanao, I'm, I'm proud and happy that I'm one of them. I'm one of the cosplayers that uh, has, this, uh, has this passion to join this contest in order to uh, show that also Mindanao has uh, great cosplayers. Yes, and I'm proud to be Davao and Mindanao go Davao. Okay. So yun, uh, that's it guys. Thank you, John Vincent. Good luck and sana mapili ang Mindanao or ikayo sa national finals. We are here with Team EXO from Davao. Hi guys! Hi! Medyo malakas ang boses natin kayo, no? Pero, come to take a fit. Kayo ang last sa roster ng mga competitors. And kayo ang nai napipili namin dito. Pinag-usapan namin kayo. You have the potential to be the competitor for the Philippines. How does it feel? Baka sinabi mo rin sa na 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 sa Avera. Ano daw? Kayo na pipili dito. Kayo na pipili yan kayo dito. Pinag-usapan kayo dito. Baka yun yung sinabi mo sa ano, yung nauna sa amin. Wala akong... I don't know what to say. Ano ba daw? Bakit na? I hope you guys enjoyed our show. I hope you guys Hindi namin na-expect yung outcome, pero I guess, paano ba ito? Hindi na natin kung makikinig sa audio yan kasi nalulunod tayo sa audio actually. Nalulunod tayo sa audio ang lakas ng boses ni Myrtle sa microphone. The cheers of the audience is ang lalakas. But then again, since ano, ano pa ano pa na pagkamdam yun na nandito kayo sa Manila. By the way, welcome to Manila. Malawis sa lab. At nakaluwas na kami ng lab. Yeah. After days of no sleep and wala ano ba? Pagod yung gagawa na sa kagagawa ng. Matulog na kami. Matulog na wakas. Like straight seven hours sleep. Nina one hour, two hours. And now the winners. This is our first actually. So I know so. Yeah, so it's very parang nakaka unexpected, surprising, and talaga na pa kahirap ng competition, no? So everyone's giving their best. Matindi talaga yung laman. So again, pagpapahingayin ko na kayo. Thank you, Team EXO! Okay, so we have here Team Albay, basically. So, part ng Team Albay, how is it na nakapunta kayo Manila? Actually, nakakapagod ang biyay pa puntang Manila. Pero sulit naman kasi maraming magagaling. And, uh, It's been a great experience. Na makasalo dito na hopefully by next year makapuntay. So sa tingin nyo, may chance kayo na makasalo as competitor, as a represented for the Philippines? As a chance, kung sa chance, merong lahat may 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 chance. Pero it's up to the judges. Kung sino pipili nila, kasi lahat naman dito pumunta hindi lang with their 75 percent, but with 125 percent. Nakikita ko sa Bicol ang pinaka-proactive na organizations doon, OBG, Anima Infinity. Sa, on your perspective, gaano ba ka-active ang cosplay community sa Bicol? Um, ang 
uh, OBG usually sila yung nag-organize talaga ng mga um, event doon and paras din kasi magkaiba sila OBG is Coral Bay and uh, Anime Infinity sa Naga kasi we're from Naga and kami yung team anime core na galing dito but and okay naman ang ano ang um, cosplay community doon nag evolve na siya ayos so with that said chances are magkakaroon uli ng representative abang Bicol next year and sa tingin mo malelev ano kumbaga paano ba malelevel up ba uh, level up ba ang Bicol next year sa tingin mo for sure kasi alam na namin yung mga pasigot-sigot kumbaga sa sa, sa WCS alright uh, thank you your name is Danny Govinson Canave from Naga and Team Anime Core, proud to be. Team Anime Core, Team Albay, ladies and gentlemen, Team Albay.